I love India. It's bigger than life. It's a photographer's dream. The colors, the chaos and the amazing people, they all beg to be photographed large. When Fujifilm gave me the opportunity to test drive the new GFX, there was really only one place to shoot this camera. And within days of being asked, I was on a plane, bound for India. I see two main reasons. Uh, the first would be the increased dynamic range. I shoot a lot in harsh lighting conditions. The GFX sensor really allows me to recover highlight detail and shadow detail without introducing visible artifacts. The second would be obviously resolution. Uh, in a city like here, Varanasi, there's loads of texture everywhere. The 50 megapixel sensor really allows me to capture that. When I first saw the images one-on-one -on, -one on screen, I was really blown away by their sharpness. I'm a wide-angle shooter, so it should be no surprise that of the three lenses that will be available at the start of the GFX, the 32-64 was my absolute favorite. The thing practically hasn't left my camera, it was almost glued to it. Now, on the other hand, for the more traditional portraits, I really love the 120 f4 and especially the fact that it's stabilized, which lets me capture that extra image sharpness. If you've ever used any Fujifilm camera in general, or the X-T2 in particular, you should feel right at home with the GFX. It's got all the great things of the X-T2, like the, the joystick to select your uh, focus point, and the two-way tilt screen, and the lockable ISO and shutter speed buttons. Now, on the other hand, if you're coming from a DSLR style of camera, I really love the fact that Fujifilm have included a C position on, the, on each lens, which lets you uh, control the aperture through the command dial. I am really looking forward to the super wide angle 23mm uh, lens and on the other hand there's also the 110mm f2 because it will really allow me to create that beautiful super shallow depth of field f2 with a medium format sensor should be really photographer's heaven so I'm looking forward to that. Mm -hmm.